Hello, Liga family. Welcome to our second informative video series about the Sustainable Development Goals. On this second edition, we will briefly explore the importance of the 2030 Agenda for LGBTI communities and cover SDG 1 and poverty in all its forms everywhere. In 2015, the UN General Assembly adopted the 2030 Agenda, a resolution containing 17 Sustainable Development Goals that will guide all the international development efforts of all nations until the year 2030. While none of these goals explicitly mention LGBTI people, the SDGs apply to us and can be employed to advance the position of our communities in all areas of society. The key entry point for LGBTI activists to the SDGs is the principle of no one will be left behind. This guiding principle can only be realised if the agenda reaches all people, regardless of their sexual orientation, gender identity, gender expression or sex characteristics. By understanding the unique features and opportunities provided by the SDG framework, LGBTI advocates may strengthen their advocacy in relevant dimensions of development, such as health, education, employment, poverty and gender equality. Did you know that in many contexts LGBTI people earn less than heterosexual and cisgender people and are more likely to be living in poverty? For instance, a 2023 study conducted in the United States demonstrated that bisexual cisgender women and transgender people had the highest percentages of poverty. These statistics show the exclusion lived by LGBTI persons from economic and social life, which influences their experience of poverty. And this is why SDG1 matters to us. This first goal has six targets, aimed at eradicating extreme poverty in all its forms, which includes the decreasing of at least half the proportion of people living on less than $1.25 a day. For this, the SDGs call all nations to ensure equal rights to economic resources and access to basic services, proper social protection systems, and reduce the exposure and vulnerability to climate-related events and other social and economic disasters. In the year 2022, the World Bank found that educational and employment barriers made Soviet-esque diverse people likely to be overrepresented in the bottom 40% of income earners. In addition, studies and reports from several countries still show higher rates of poverty within our community. This economic exclusion increases when we take into consideration the intersectional forms of discrimination that LGBTI persons face. For instance, LGBTI persons with disabilities or belonging to ethnic minorities. If you want to know more about the 2030 Agenda and its links to LGBTI people, check out our article SOEX Advocacy and the Sustainable Development Goals. You can find the link in the caption of this video. If you are willing to get more involved and engage with the SDGs, we would be more than happy to help you out. For example, if you have any data or testimonies showing that queer or LGBTI communities in your country are disproportionately affected by poverty, it doesn't have to be official comprehensive data but at least some reliable information, we can use that data to improve the situation of the LGBT community in your country. If you do want to share this kind of information with us, or if you have any questions or comments, you can always contact us at sp at ilga.org. That's it for now. Don't forget to share this video and see you next time.